Hi everyone, it's Crafting Vicky here and uh, I'm here this time to share with you a little project that I made using an Art by Myran image and uh, it's my turn to host the um, showcase blog so I figured it was a great uh, time to uh, share with you a little project and I like, I'm starting to really like doing videos and uh, doing mixed media so I thought, you know, it can uh, serve both uh, both blogs, um, my blog as well as Art by My Rant. So here you see me gessoing a little uh, piece of wood and this little art piece is going to be in my Etsy store so you can find the information below uh, as to where you can purchase it. And uh, the theme for the month of um, November uh, is actually warm colors so to me warm colors means browns oranges reds and that sort of color so that's what I went with um, so here I'm doing the base coat of um, my little piece of wood the image uh, was colored with my Copics and then I put some stickles all over the wings of the cute little image and um, I colored her in yellowish orangey colors so I figured if I put the base as brown like that, it would really fit. Um, here you see me using a little, uh, uh, it's a mixed media little tool and it has little teeth, kind of like a little comb and it's in silicone. So it's uh, perfect to uh, put some little uh, colors like that. And I decided to um, do it in a tan color because that was as well the base. And here I decided to put some, uh, some little, uh, leftover pieces of paper uh, that I took in my scrap bin. I'm using a lot of my scraps through uh, these little projects so it's a lot of fun. Uh, here is a Tim Holtz uh, actual tissue paper. I have purchased a roll of those. It's, it's kind of like um, the um, you know when you buy um, uh, some um, what's it called? The, um, the wax paper. I'm having a blank sorry uh, yeah it's like you when you buy the wax paper it comes in a roll like that and it's a wonderful paper and has beautiful butterflies and some uh, music and it's just gorgeous and um, I, I kind of hoard it I don't know about you guys but I have trouble using the stuff that I love like that here I'm using some um, art foamies if they're wonderful little uh, foam stamps and uh, it's from a Canadian company based in um, British Columbia so I was really happy to uh, be supporting them and, and using their product and so I, I painted the uh, orange directly on the flower and made it easier to stamp instead of trying to uh, put as much paint on the um, on the sheets you know and here I'm using one of those um, that little plastic piece that you saw me use is actually come off from some sort of item and my father found it in his garage and figured I might use it so I used it here to put all kinds of little bronze circle all over my uh, little piece of um, of wood and it really does add some great interest and it shows that you can use pretty much anything you want you don't have to be limited by just you know craft supplies that are expensive you can just use whatever you find here I'm trying to place my little uh, flower that I've made uh, I have some of those in my Etsy store and uh, I decided as well to use some lace on it and uh, so here I'm coating everything with my gloss medium and um, I'm, it's also a varnish so at the same time it's uh, varnishing the piece and then I can uh, use my wax to uh, make it less sticky. I'm using a sentiment that comes from Unity Stamps. I love those stamps. I'm um, addicted to them actually. I'm part of their club and I get them monthly and I just adore them. It's, uh, it's probably one of my favorite uh, go-to places for stamps right now. Uh, so I thought, you know, the, the, the little lace was a bit blah. It kind of was too white so I decided to put some more of my bronzer on it and then I actually wiped some of it down afterwards and uh, put the varnish on top of it again just to make sure that it was really gonna stay and here is the beeswax I love the, the 
way that it just, you know, puts warmth to the, the piece and makes it all smooth and everything. Here I'm using one of the little pop, ta pop tabs from uh, a soda can as the uh, holding in the back. So very cheap way and recyclable and I just love that. And I didn't want to squish my flower too much, that's why I'm holding it this way. And of course my stamp with my signature so that uh, it shows that it's me that made it. And then to finish it off I had pulled out from my um, from my craft stuff uh, little flowers in metal. So that's what I'm putting here and gluing with my E6000. And that's it! So love it! Hope you love it, love it too. And you can go and uh, check it out on my Etsy store. And don't forget to like my video and subscribe. See you soon. Bye.